Shields up, Iron Breakers. How's everybody doing today? Watch me be muted. I'm not, I'm not muted. God damn, that's a good start. I mean, at least as good as it gets. Um, been pretty, pretty busy with a newborn. She has kept me awake, but listen, 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 guys. I've realized something, okay? I've realized something I'm gonna have to, um, gonna have to, uh, talk about it, which is I've been slacking. And that shit is just not right. It is not right to be a slacker. So, I do want to get a bit of progress going on today, if I can at all. We'll see. We'll see if that is a possibility. I was uh, trying out Striker. I was trying out Striker Charge Blade. Didn't like it. Didn't like Striker Charge Blade at all. Which means I want to swap it. Want to swap it? Want to swap it for something else? Uh, I think I'm gonna go Valor because I do want to play Charge Blade. We're gonna take SP Ripper Shield. Ripper Shield is S. I thought it was M. Or is that on Striker? No, it's still S. Huh? Interesting. Don't matter. Okay, now. Man, YouTube, could you stop filtering my messages? Like, I'm not... Guys, like, I'm sorry. Some of you guys' messages are getting automatically filtered by YouTube. And it's like, what the fuck is... YouTube is basically saying that... Cuss messages with evil words in them are spam. Because that's the only thing that I have for blocking. I have it for blocking spam. And YouTube's like, ah, there's a cuss word in there. It must be spam. <laughs> that's crazy. I allow all kinds of words on my chat because that's the way it is. So long as you're not offending somebody else to a ridiculous extent. But anyway, uh, Matt B, Allison, Yuri, Almeida, Dal Panino, why the fuck are you still playing this game? Because I fucking love it. That's why. Got a problem with that? <laughs> Matt, be upset about Nintendo Online. I haven't even checked Nintendo Online. I gotta talk with Nintendo, see if they're up for, uh, for maybe providing me with a code or something. <laughs> uh, Edwin Volstra, good evening. Grandpa Bear, first time on your stream, fuck yeah. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Stream going with Twitch or just going with YouTube exclusive? Tanae, Tamel, I usually avoid dual streaming so that I can actually focus on chat whenever I'm not like hardcore into the action that is taking place in the game. Bad guy five, what is up? Andrew C, what's going on, dude? American companies worry cussing is bad. Come the fuck on. Come the fuck on, dude. Like look, I understand, you know, maybe you're a parent, maybe your children might be watching me. It's like, look, your children are good. They're going to be exposed to bad words at some point in their life. As a father, I've already exposed mine to quite a few, unfortunately. Maybe way sooner than they should have. But ultimately, I'm not trying to, like, get a super, super mega young audience that I can exploit to sell merch. Oh, throwing shade on so many people at the same time. It is 20 bucks a year, bad guy five. It is 20 bucks a year. Uh, or at least I've heard it's 20 bucks a year. I haven't really checked yet but anyways we're gonna go valor with ripper shield i gotta be honest not sure how i feel about limit breaker i need to actually read up on limit breaker to see how much that is worth but we're gonna go ripper shield with sp just for me to test it out and we'll see how that fares for now though let's see what quests we got going i just killed a gipsros Actually, I should check which ones are key quests, because I'll probably have to do some of the boring ones. So we're currently on quests, rarity 7 for village. Key quest, brave new ore. 
Oh man, I'm gonna have to do like... It's not even unlocked yet. Us Hunter... Us Hunter is a key quest. That's disappointing. Deliver five burned husks. I mean, because I'm not taking my hunter for that. To hell with that, dude. Not taking my hunter. How many hours you got in, M in MHGU so far? Uh, I believe close to 20. But that's not counting the 130 plus that I had on Generations. Because the save doesn't really keep track. So if we count that, it would be like 150, 160. But even still, like, I take my sweet time. It's just right now I do feel like I need to get closer to endgame. Because there's still so much stuff to do. So I'm probably going to start going a little bit more beast mode. Although I, I do hate that having to... I mean, you don't have to use the Prowler, but it's just a waste of time using your Hunter to do a collect quest. And I'm very much efficiency-oriented. Current sets Prowler. Adam has been swapped. Okay, take us to that husk thing. I don't even know where to get the damn burning husks. Burned husks. Should I even eat? No, oh, why not? Just give me whatever, dude. Give me, like, attack. Can I get attack? No? It's too, it's too much to ask to get attack? No, we got Rhino. Artful Sandwich makes it easier to stun monsters. Can I get... Oh, yeah. Potency of abnormal attacks, because my weapon does have blast. What the what? Are you playing as a palico? It's called Prowler. Thank you very much. Yeah, I'm playing as a Prowler. That's something that you can do in Generations and Generations Ultimate. All for Sloth. How much fun are you having when compared to Monster Hunter World? I mean, it's not going to be as much because I've, I've made my position perfectly clear about that. I like Monster Hunter World more, but I still really like this one as well. I do... I almost feel like it's always necessary for me to explain the whole part. That I still stand by what I said in that Generations versus 4 Ultimate video. Where I said that the start of this game is not good. Okay? Because probably people see me, Oh man, Rurikon, look at you sound out. And all of a sudden you like Generations Ultimate. No, I, I always like both. I like For You more. And um, I think that the start of this game is terrible. Although I do have to admit, now that I've played... So much world. Because, like, world was the first Moss Hunter that I really dived into. And, oh my god, what the fuck? Really? A Gipsros? I'm not fighting a high rank Gipsros with a Prowler. Screw that. But I'm still having a lot of fun. It's just, like, I like world more. It's, it's just the way it is. And some people will like this one more. And that's fine. That's cool. So long as you're enjoying Monster Hunter, that's all good, baby. It's all good. Start is okay if you're new to Monster Hunter. No, it's not. As a matter of fact, I would say it's the opposite. The start of Generations is fucking atrocious. Especially if you're new to Monster Hunter. And you don't actually know how the game works. And you don't know what expects you in the late game. Because you're not going to know if all those things you're doing are actually worth it. Because it's boring as hell. Yeah, I don't like underwater combat either. I played underwater combat with the Gunlance, though, back in the day. I, didn't, I don't think I even was using the Gunlance properly, though. <laughs> I was such a nooblet back then. Still nooblet back now in this one. Definitely slow, though. Dude, it's atrocious. Come on. Definitely slow. It's terrible. Let's be honest. Like, the game can still be good, even if it has a bad start. Oh, is this what we're looking for? Oh... This looks like some, uh... This looks like some Volstrax shit right here. What do you guys want? You guys want some, huh? Fucking lurking around? Huh? You want some, bitch? Lurking around my palicos? Huh? You wanna take that beating? Yeah, that's what I thought. Now I'm gonna take your scales. Because I actually need those. Or I needed those. I don't think I need those anymore. You have a phobia of deep water, so the under combat. Well, it was immersive as hell on uh, Tribe, the underwater combat. It was pretty friggin' immersive, so I can understand. If you have a phobia of deep waters, I can understand why. 
More prowlers wish they had that in world. Uh, you don't understand the level of complexity that prowlers have in this game, dude. If, if you're if you're like, man, I wish world had more prowlers. Trust me, no, you don't. Like, you need to understand if they if they would just like take the prowlers, like if they were to release this game with only the prowlers and no hunters whatsoever, this game would still have more content than a lot of $60 games. With just the prowlers, no other weapons, okay? And it would still be deeper than a lot of $60 games. This is just to give you like a basic idea on the complexity of the prowler system. I naturally always take advantage whenever I have one of these quests to, uh, oh, deliver something, something. I'm always collecting stuff all over the place, so that basically that enables you to not collect as often when you're actually looking to hunt. Like, I want to hunt with Charge Blade, so and chill. I just realized I put that on start, and then because of the quest that I was doing, because it's a key quest, I'm not playing with a prowler. So I apologize if you're watching this after the fact and you're like, Oh man, I turned in for some sword and shield and, and charge blade and you're playing with the prowler and it's like, yeah, it's, I always do collection quests with the prowler. The Mud Pie Man was genuinely looking into getting a switch just for this. I always say, you shouldn't get a switch just for one game. You shouldn't get any console just for one game. Like, I mean, if you have this, the disposable income, sure. But ultimately, there's so many other really good games on the Switch. You got Zelda. You got, um, what's the name of that game that I haven't finished yet that I friggin' love? Um, Octopath Traveler. You got, uh, Splatoon if you're into that. You got Mario Kart 8. You're gonna get, uh, Super Smash Brothers. You can, there's f so many friggin' good games. I still have to play Hollow Knight, which I didn't get to play yet. Uh, Dead Cells is also on here, and there's plenty of more other... Ex Xenoblade Chronicles! How can I even forget? Xenoblade Chronicles 2, dude. And I hope that they do a remaster of Xenoblade Chronicles X. You're gonna get Travis Strikes again. Suda51 is currently working on bringing us No More Heroes 1 and 2. And I hope he friggin' succeeds, because I want to play Desperate Struggle, because I never finished it. Kyle Nelson, why no Twitch stream? Uh, like I said, I am streaming on both platforms. But mostly I've been dedicated more, dedicating more time on YouTube because I just seem to get more people watching me on YouTube. Like, most of my community is on YouTube. So I, just, I have to be not negligent. I have to be not a negligent father, you know? Bad guy 5. I miss Squadron as well, dude. We don't really play the same games, though. Like, I wish Squadron would play Moss on a World so that I could go over there and teach him. It can even be on PC. I got the PC copy. I highly doubt that anyone on there is uh, further than I am in, in World on PC because I'm not... Am I even in a high rank? I might have just gotten in a high... I, I don't remember. I don't remember if I even made it to high rank on the PC side of things because this has been so much happening, you know? New Animal Crossing? I don't know. What are your thoughts regarding the Nintendo Online? I mean, I haven't gotten to experiment it yet, so I don't know about the, um, you know, those retro games that you get. But ultimately, the thing about it is that I don't have nostalgia. I don't have nostalgia for Nintendo, and I don't mean that in a bad way. It's just I was a, a Mega Drive kid, which for those of you in the U.S., you guys are going to be like, The fuck is a Mega Drive? Mega Drive is the name that they called the Genesis in Europe. So I grew up with the Genesis. So, you know, I have... What the fuck? The fuck are you doing? You're a goddamn herbivore. What the fuck are you attacking prowlers for? Are you insane? You're crazy. This friggin' creature's crazy. You're gonna really... I'm gonna release the beast. That's it. That's it. I didn't even touch this friggin' herbivore, I was just chillin'. 
friggin' herbivore. It's just like, oh man, I'm gonna attack this palico. This seems like a good idea. I'm saving your day to day with a stream. Things going bad again, Kegrin? Come on, dude. Like, you can't absorb all of that shit. You gotta let some of it go, dude. It's. You can't be responsible for everything. We can't save everyone. You know, you gotta have some fun yourself, dude. Remax is only crap to join the stream for the first time, and my tempered monster hunt gave me an attack and crit up gem as it loaded. See, that's the Rurikon effect. Everybody that watch my streams gets attack gems, but only when I'm streaming, so that they can rub it in my face. That's how it works. It's okay, though. I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you. Like, secretly, my heart is telling me to tell you to go fuck yourself, but, you know, I'm happy for you. You had an accident. Fresh coffee spilled over my belly, legs, and balls. Oh man! So you little you literally made a caffeinated tea. You dipped your balls in it. <laughs> oh man. Okay, listen. You're gonna make me beat the crap out of you, Gips Rose. You're not gonna make me do that, are you? Because I will beat the ever-living snot out of you. You ugly dragon. Ugly, thieving dragon. Because he steals shit off of you. US alien games are attack gems rare. On Masa Hunter World, they are not only rare, they don't exist. Like, the game will tell you, yeah, sure, these gems exist. It's a lie. They don't actually exist. That's how rare they are. They so rare that they might as well be called unobtainium. Now rubbish, I currently only have four attack jewels and 500 plus hours. Bro, I got a thousand, over a thousand and one hundred, because now it's over a thousand one hundred hours, and I only have two attack gems, and one of those is the one that you get guaranteed 100% from doing story quests. Okay? Two with more than twice your game time. Rurikon, do I need Pro Control for Moss on a GU or Joy-Con is enough for that? I'm playing with a Joy-Con. Uh, basically, I would say if there is other games that you are planning on playing and you really feel like you want to get the Pro Controller, get it. Because I do feel like it is not perfect, you know? Especially after playing World for so long with a DualShock 4. Like, this is... A million, like literally a million times better than the 3DS. Like, if I don't know if any of you guys played Monster Hunter games on 3DS. And like this right here, a million times better than the 3DS. But, um, you know, it still doesn't really match up to a proper control. A proper controller could still be a little better. A little better. So... I might, I'm, I am also considering buying a Pro Controller. Not just for this, but because I play a lot of games on the Switch where I kind of feel like the Pro Controller would be good. Wow, did... Did I pick up... I picked up the paint balls, right? Anyway, no, I picked up the potions. They didn't even drop paint balls. Evil. Why so evil? And also, I've heard good things about the Pro Controller. Like, I've heard people that played with the Pro Controller that actually prefer it over the DualShock 4, which is very, very surprising for me. Lucio, have you played Zelda Breath of the Wild yet? Yes, I have. I played it through the completion. I did not play the DLC that released afterwards. I plan on doing that eventually, but I loved uh, Breath of the Wild. Breath of the Wild, in my opinion, was the best game that came out last year. And it is one of the best games to have come out on uh, the past couple of years because it's just a really good game. Like, you know how a lot of games nowadays are doing open world? Breath of the Wild did it better than most games. Breath of the Wild was able to really bring in a breath of fresh air 
no pun intended, to the open world genre. Straight up. You can use a PS4 controller with the Switch if you get Bluetooth adapter from Amazon. Yep, I know. I know. But it's like, you know, I'd rather use a Pro Controller. The thing is, Pro Controller is expensive as a motherfucker. You know, real expensive. I have my main complaints. It's like 70 euros for a Pro Controller, dude. It's like, come on. It's, it's a little bit too much. Like, I understand there's hella technology on the fucking thing, but it's still a little bit too much. Let's see uh, what's the next key quest that I need to be working on to advance. Us Hunter, Fashion Victim, Daimyo Amatar, Friend of Need, Baroth. We already did that. I don't think I have the Fashion Victim quest yet, do I? Probably don't. Bug Appetit on Core. Already did that. Ooh, the Kongalala. Poison for action. Did that. Spit it out. Hunt a Tetsukabra. Okay, if we're gonna hunt a Tetsukabra, I can now use my, um, my charge blade. I wanted to use the Valor charge blade. So let's try it out. Hey, Forever Long, what's up? Gotta try that strategy of farming decos while watching this stream. Yeah, dude! Trust me! Source! Trust me! Uh, it'll work. At least it has definitely been proven by a lot of people that they have gotten quite a few good decorations while watching my live streams. So that's a good thing to do when you're deco farming. Uh, anyway, let me just, uh, what did I do here? Ba -da -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Gym style slash arts, valor, ripper shield, SP. Good. Let's go. You ready for the new festival on Moss Island World? I plan on doing a live stream when that thing goes live, so good stuff. Gorkan, can't decide if I should play Xenoblade Chronicles 2 or GU. Uh, you should play Xenoblade Chronicles 2 so that I could catch up to you on GU. Because you're way ahead of me on GU, and I'm not going to want to play with you because you're going to carry. And I don't want to get carried. You know me. I hate getting carried, bro. So you should play Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Uh, oh yeah, we're playing Spit It Out. Rura can do what Iron Jesus can't. You damn straight! You damn straight I can, son! Alright, let's get started. Sit bench, order meal. I want more attack. Can I get more attack? Reno Heartful Sandwich. A Reno Heartful Sandwich. Also, Kegrin, shame on you for making me jealous of you, because, like, I can't dedicate myself to Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Because my backlog is getting too fucking big! My backlog is bigger than, I don't know, something that's really big. My backlog is bigger than Kulf to Roth. How's that? I did not check where we're hunting. Where are we hunting? Jurassic Frontier. Okay, that's good. That'll do. <clears throat> in that case, I don't really need anything, do I? Yeah, I'm good. It's Tetsukabra. Go in there. Beat his shit. Do you think Monster Hunter World is the best Monster Hunter game for beginners? I could get that one. And or the 3DS ones is my first Monster Hunter. Kind of want to get into it. Lucio, without a doubt... Get Monster Hunter World. Without a shadow of a doubt, bro. Without a single hint of hesitation, I can tell you, get Monster Hunter World. It is the best Monster Hunter for beginners. Just be aware of something. If you want to get into these uh, old ones after that one, it's going to be real hard. It's going to be real hard. I'd love to be able to do guides like I did for World, but... It's so hard, because th there's just better stuff out there, you know, like Gaijin Hunter has much better mastery of this game than I do, for instance. So, I'm... It's just not something that I can do at this point. Like, look at this, I'm still only high rank, I'm not even in G rank, I'm not even at the end game of this game yet. 
I'm even at the point where I'm wondering, should I even be crafting armors? You know? What I should be doing, actually, is getting a friggin... A friggin' map, because I'm gonna get lost in this place. Oh, those things are just gonna be all throughout the world now, eh? Okay. Ray WPP, I appreciate it, dude. Like, I will eventually do stuff on this game, but I need to at least get to the end game, you know? <clears throat> yeah, exactly, Kegrin. You do know more about this game than I do, and you don't even know that much yourself. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that crazy? It, in a lot of ways, it's like a Brave New World, but don't you feel, though, Kegrin, that after playing World, at least, because I definitely feel that way, I feel that after playing World, I now have a much better understanding of the older games, whereas previously there was stuff in the older games that I, I wouldn't even consider. Hey, what the frack? Oh, that's right, you can't... You can't actually do the charge double slash on Valor. I forgot about that. Oh no, wait, you can't. Jesus, I completely forgot how to play Valor. Ah. Aha! Is this available on YouTube Gaming? They have a better layout for video and chat. Yes, it is. Yes, it is, Leroy. You just go to gaming.youtube slash Ruricon. You should see it there. Uh, however, you might not want to get used to that. <laughs> I know if you know, but YouTube Gaming is, uh, it's dead. A couple of months from now, they're going to shut it down. They're going to shut down YouTube Gaming for good. I mean, they only said the app, though. I'm not sure if they're going to shut down the website front. But yeah, they're, they're getting rid of the YouTube gaming app. Oh, hi, Tetsu. How you doing, bro? Can I get an ouch? That hurts. Oh, I can't even swap into axe mode when I'm not valid. Bastard, you're about to get it. You're about to get that good D. The good D! Just completely wasted my ability there. Hey yo. Combo it. 
No, you can't. Okay. Oh, come on. I'm a little bit rusty with Valor, so bear with me, guys. What the hell? I just completely mispressed. That's what you get, baby girl. Oh, you bastard. Oh, yeah. Oh, on that ugly head of yours. Okay, so we're out of valor. Should have valored out of it instead of dodging. Okay, I gotta try that Ripper Shield thing again. But I knew I do need a Tyrant first. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. Right? Oh, come on! That was some hitbox right there. I got cheesed. Come on, mount. Give me a mount. You gotta give me a mount, bro. This ain't working. Okay, that's fine. It's leaving. Gives me a chance to sharpen, gives me a chance to charge my files. I keep forgetting that I gotta, I gotta get my ass into Valor faster. Again, Valor is something that you do need to get used to, and I haven't played Valor in quite some time. <clears throat> also, I haven't played Charge Blade in quite some time. How do I craft the stones to make my weapon sharper? Please answer. Uh, are you talking about Monster Hunter World or Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate, dude? Whetstone recipe? No, you don't craft that. You get it. You need to find the the places where you can where you can get that stuff. You don't actually craft it. It's like uh, I gotta be honest. I I don't even remember what it looks like, but it's like a rock on the ground, and you go over there and you kind of harvest it. I farmed the crap out of it on generations. That's why I have so many. Or you can mine them. Yeah, you can also mine them. Or you can buy them. I completely forgot. You can also buy them. There's that. I'm gonna saw your nuts off! Oh, yeah. He's a eunuch now. What's up? 
God, that feels so good. The weapon sharpness is legendary right here. <laughs> My weapon sharpness so good. Oh! Jesus Christ, that looked beautiful because it was right in time with the flash bomb. All part of the plan, boys. Get mounted! Mount him! Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. You know you want it! Booyah! Ooh. God, that's so good. Wait, was that an empty one? I thought I had files. I wasn't even paying attention. Did I just dry Super Anthem? Wait, where are all the shinies? There were two shinies in here. They're already gone? Dude, I got robbed. I got robbed. Something fierce. The legends say Ruri killed an Aptonoth with red sharpness. Crazy, right? That's no legend. I probably did that at some point. <clears throat> I'd be surprised if I hadn't done it. But the reason I bounced off there, I'm not even sure if it was the sharpness or if it was the fact that uh, the blade was overcharged and I wasn't paying attention. Hey, yo! Crack! the hell? Oh, that's right, I can't. I was trying to go into axe mode and you can't. <laughs> I was like, what's going on? Is he leaving already? What a pussy. What a pussy. Where are you gonna run to, Tetsu? You ain't going nowhere, son. I already did that. I already did that. You can just repeatedly do the, the other move. It's great. Oh, man. You're just being an extremely annoying little plot, aren't ya? Aren't ya? I'm actually thinking that the way that I'm playing, Limit Breaker might actually be a better skill. Because you don't really get to do Super Amps until you get into Valor. So it's not like I need all of these files. I could afford to charge them twice. Oh my god, you're annoying! Then I would do the really massive super amps. You need to make up your mind as to where you're going. What the hell? Oh, you can swap. You just have to... Oh my god, never mind, never mind. I take everything back. I was playing this thing all wrong. I'm sorry. Like I said. I haven't played a uh, Valor Charge Blade in a while. <clears throat> Can you draw into Axe Mode? Actually, I don't know. Let me check. But you can get into you can get into Axe Mode by Valor swapping. I I just com I didn't even know.
See, this is why I'm not doing guides for Generations Ultimate. <laughs> what do you mean there's this move that I had no idea you couldn't do? Yeah, you can draw into Axe as well. Although right now I am in Valor, so I don't know if that's why. But... Can common and rare cores give unique blades? I believe so. I've gotten uniques out of rares, at least on the first single blade. Wait, you never finished the original one, right? Because, I mean, if you never finished the original one, I don't know if you have the season pass, but you might actually want to start with Torna. Because it's a prequel. Like, knowing what I know now, and if I hadn't played the original one, I would probably start with Torna. Because I think it will make... Um, I think it will make for a better experience if you play Torna first. I think. Let's just put it this way. If I had a choice right now, I would play Torna first. And then I would play the actual game. Can you make, make builds like in World with different pieces of armor? Yes. It may also spoil, spoil some revelations from the original Xenoblade Chronicles too. It might. It might. You're not wrong. I mean, basically when... Uh, when the green version of that character shows up in Xenoblade Chronicles 2, you will immediately know who she is. Spit it out, hunt a Tetsukabra, investment flanking, hunt a Geodrome, taking royal liberties. Tell me that the killer rabbit, killer rabbit is not. Conga line is not. Then what am I missing? Investment flanking. <clears throat> Brave new ore. I don't see the brave new ore. Maybe there's characters that I gotta speak to. Yeah, there's a red thing here. It's probably the, the lab. I always forget to go to the lab. Like I give a damn about that. Item box start. Increase the number of items and equipment that you can keep in your item box. Or via the Palico board. Why do I care? Whatever. I have the points. Expands your supply drops. This set includes an old pickaxe. And... I don't need supply drops, bro. What am I playing? A strategy game over here? Come on. Come on! Get real. I just need Cha-Cha and Kayamba. Can I have Cha-Cha and Kayamba? No. Royal Ludruth. Okay, gotta go kill these.
Is that a green glowing Kushala charge blade in Generations? No. This is, um... This is a Brocky Dios charge blade. Brocky! And if you only played World, you don't know what a Brocky Dios looks like. Speaking of which, I wanted to upgrade this, but I don't think I can. Can I? Also can't up upgrade my blaggard. I need Gormagala wings. And for this one, I need Teostra's horns. I need to go kill a Teostra. I think I can actually kill a low-level Teostra, right? That's available on on the guild. Now nah, that n guild, yeah, it's available on the HUD. Hub. It's available on the hubba. Hubba hubba hubba. <clears throat> Brachidios, the original slime blast monster. Yeah, because before blast was blast, it was called slime. Slime! Where are we fighting again? Because I didn't pay attention. Because I never pay attention. Because I'm a slacker. Misty Peaks. Misty Peaks, I don't need potions for that, so we're good. We Gucci. <clears throat> What's good is that this game has a lot of variance in the weapon visuals. Yep. Like, it is, it is hands down better than World in that aspect. Like, sure, World's weapons will look, you know, more highly detailed and all of that stuff, but ultimately... I've never been about the graphics. I love good graphics, I love good visuals, but they're not the main reason for me to play video games. And I still love the art style of this Monster Hunter, by the way. As a matter of fact, one of the things that I said is that I would like to see the gameplay of World with this art style. Although preferably without the loading in between zones, that'd be cool too. Is there any tips or important things to know while you're going through the low and high ranks? Most important tip of all. Have fun. Yeah, there's there's really not uh, many tips. I mean, I guess it depends on what how fast you want to get to endgame. If you're not in a rush, just take your time. Craft the armor sets that you want. Uh, try to get materials as you play through it. Oh no, wait, I guess I do have a tip, like, I, it's probably the, the biggest tip of all, which is whenever you have a quest to kill smaller monsters, or uh, just to do gathering stuff, take a prowler. <clears throat> because you don't have to waste, you don't have to waste, like, uh, materials and stuff. Yeah, upgrade, um, upgrade armor when you get to, to high rank. On low rank, I'm not sure that you need it all that much, but for high rank, for sure, upgrade your armor. Man, my voice is going. I don't know what's going on. I think it's because of the air conditionings. I've been exposed to too many air conditionings, and my voice is making me pay for that. So I apologize. <clears throat> Maybe it's just me, but it looks like you run faster in that game. It's a completely different engine, so it's hard to even compare. He's still alive? Give it up, dude. Friggin' Jaggy over there. Bri, have you heard that Sony is doing a Nintendo and launching a PlayStation Classic? Yep. That's another console that I don't really have... Um, I don't really have nostalgia for, so... That's great! <clears throat> Uh, 
It's like the thing that I have nostalgia for is World of Warcraft. And I'm already playing World of Warcraft again, so there you go. Hey, Kegrin, I heard you got killed by one of these not so long ago. <laughs> Motherfucker. How dare you? How damn dare you? That's one tough tail that you got there. Yeah, I'm gonna give him the treatment. I think he needs it. <clears throat> You are gonna get it so bad. Ah, oh, <laughs> the cock block right there, dude. I'm not using Valor at all right now. That's my problem. Wow, did he crack the head already? Okay, let's give him the treatment. Ooh, you scumbag. You're gonna get it. Come here. I really need better sharpness on this. Holy crap, does it automatically charge you? How did it charge? That was cool, but I don't know how I did it.
The sharpness. The sharpness is killing me right now. What's the name of your palico? Uh, the name of my palico is Zelda and Tail Flash. Uh, Zelda, I believe, was actually one of those palicos that you could get uh, in DLC or something. So yeah. Burkhan, do you have a favorite monster? Uh, I mean, I'm very basic. So it's like, if I had to pick a favorite monster, I'd, it'd be Rathalos. But um, a monster that I really, really like that is not like my favorite, but it's still a monster I really like is the Kurupek. Damn it, I keep forgetting how to do the swap. I might have to actually go farm some redstones. <laughs> I love how the gargoyles just appeared right after and they're like, yup, what's up? Anybody got a problem in here? Somebody mad, somebody mad. Okay, I gotta check something out. If you could go ahead and actually hit me, because I need to test the theory. Do it, you bastard. Hit me. Thank you. Oh, then how did I charge it? I would really like to know how I charged it earlier. Was it when I entered Valor? I wonder if it was when I entered Valor. It probably must have. time I gotta test it. Did I just guard point that? I think I did. I'm 
And by the way, I know that I have to charge it. I'm just testing a theory. No, it didn't do it. I did something earlier that caused me to charge automatically, and I don't know what it was. I gotta check the Hunter's move set after that. charge was from using ripper shield so if i use ripper shield it charges the um the charge blade it's not aware of that i knew that i did something that charged it and i was trying to figure out what it was is that kutku armor yep i'm getting attack up bell with this armor right now it's just, I needed a good high rank armor. I crafted an armor that gave me KO to play with hammer, but then I swapped the sword and shield and I just wanted something with attack. So I ended up with this. Yesterday I tried playing Moss Hunter Generations Ultimate only to find out that I had to pay. In order to play multiplayer, yes. Idris, you just got to remind yourself of something. Gameplay is why you play Monster Hunter World. It's not because of the pretty visuals. The artistic value is much more important than uh, the fidelity of the visuals. And now you guys are going to say, Oh, but you, you didn't play the 3DS ones that much. Yes, because they were on the fucking 3DS and the controls are terrible. Rathalos armor is good for attack up hell and weakness exploit. Yeah, but I haven't unlocked high rank Rathalos in uh, in village quests yet. Brave new war. Okay. <clears throat> Time to go get my uh, my prowler. I know I got a mounting plus ten. That it's pretty good. Isn't that pretty good? Just just straight up. Hey, I need I need to get the mount skill. Oop. Speaking of which, I'm glad that you reminded me because I believe that currently the the neck no the neck piece that I'm using is giving me attack. Never mind. For a second, I thought that I didn't have like a proper neck piece, but I do. I do. giving me these special permits. I'm pretty sure I'd get my ass kicked if I tried to do any of these. The online rooms are still packed full on regular Monster Hunter 4. That's pretty impressive. Would not expect that. Would not expect that at all. So 
so if I remember correctly, Comet Rock is basically just mining. You should fight the new Diablos, the new Deviant. Probably get one shot by that damn thing. <clears throat> You guys just want me to die repeatedly. I, I'm sensing a pattern. I'm such a nice guy, and you guys just want me to die. Hey, Molten Freak, what's up? By the way, Kagarin, did you end up seeing the, the vote that I put up on the, um, on the YouTube community thing? I asked people, because I've received a lot of requests recently about playing Destiny 2, and I asked people, should I do it and stream it? And the overwhelming majority voted, nope. Have you played with a lance or gun lance yet? Not on this game. What's the advantage of playing Palico as opposed to a hunter? I only played Moss Hunter World, so you have no experience with this game. Uh, Palicos don't need for you to bring pickaxes. You don't need to bring bug nets. You don't need to bring cool drinks. You don't need to bring hot drinks. Basically, Palicos, you don't need to bring anything they can't even use potions so you save on your consumables you don't have to use any consumables to do gathering missions you just come around hang out and the gear and crafting for palicos is much simpler than crafting for hunters so you know they're just like a much lighter version of a monster hunter character with a lot of quality of life things for when you're doing gathering so whenever there's a gathering mission or a mission to just fight small monsters. I'll bring out the Prowler, beat the crap out of them. Where you should give Valor Gunlance a go sometime, it's satisfyingly fun. The problem is that I haven't mastered the combo of the gun lance in this game because it's a lot more complex. You have to like do the whole heat gauge management thing on top of all the other things that you already have to do on a gun lance. So I was like, holy shit, the hell is this? Should I shell? Should I attack? I don't know what's going on. And I just kind of like didn't touch it. Are there talons in this game? Because I haven't really checked yet. <laughs> Comet Rock 5. I need 10 of this, right? How many palicos can you have at the same time? Two or three if you're playing as a prowler. But you can own a bunch of them. I don't even know how many I own. Do you use dual blades in Moss on World? I know how to play dual blades in Moss on World. Why? Nitro Shroom. Yesterday I made a video that I actually didn't publish, but I still feel like I want to, you know? It's a video talking about how we no longer have. I mean, not that we no longer have that, that's a gross exaggeration. 
It's um, it was a video about how a large portion of video game journalists nowadays they're not really video game journalists anymore. But I'm concerned whether or not that's the kind of video that I want to be getting into, if that's the kind of arena that I want to get into. There's so much controversy around that bullshit, and I really don't like milking controversy. But at the same time, I can't stand some of the news that I've been seeing, you know? Hey, Vin Helm, what's up? Do you think they'll ever make a Monster Hunter World Ultimate sometime in the future? What would you like to see improved? I hope they did, but the more time passes, the more I doubt they will. You know? Because I just feel like they're treating it more as a live service. And that'd be weird for a live service like, Oh yeah, here's the ultimate version of the, the you know, Monster Hunter World. I, I don't know. It's weird that we're on uncharted territory for Capcom, so I don't know. Which one, Leroy? I've seen at least two of them that basically insult the NYPD. And I don't know how bad the NYPD is, because I don't live in New York, but I still don't like the idea of people insulting their local police department. Give me a second, I need to turn on the light. They're not weak looking, they're just different. If you master the moveset, it can be as good as the hammer. And even better than the hammer in groups. It's just way harder to master. It was the one where some guy told you you changed into Matt something as Spider-Man. Oh, the one where I talked about, the one where I talked about uh, Clean Prince Gaming, as an example. And the other guy said that I was Ma uh, Monday Matt, and I was like, I'm not Monday Matt, <laughs> the fuck? He's gathering stuff while the cat... Rurikon is gathering stuff while the cat's in the back are getting their asses kicked. Yeah, it's... The whole purpose of this quest is to gather, so... They're just useful distractions. And they're pretty happy. You see the icons next to their faces? They're pretty happy. They're excited. They're having fun. Which one do you think will be released first? Moss Honor World Ultimate or Moss Honor for the Switch? Moss Honor for the Switch. Because Capcom and a lot, other, a lot of other developers were blindsided by the success of the Switch. As a matter of fact, if the Switch, if they knew that the Switch was going to be this successful, Monster Hunter World would have been on the Switch as opposed to the other consoles. It would have been a different game, but it would have been on the Switch. I guarantee you. How many rocks do I have now? I haven't even checked. Seven. Three more.
Which one? Uh, sorry. Furacan, what was your first Moss Honor game? Moss Honor Try, and I hated it. Because I didn't know a single thing about Monster Hunter. So I tried playing, and I was like, good god, the controls on this game fucking sucks. I don't know how to play this fucking game. I don't know why this character moves so slow. Like, you're talking about someone who went from playing World of Warcraft to playing Monster Hunter. Like, that was my... Tr I transitioned from World of Warcraft into Monster Hunter. And I just like, nope, this game fucking sucks. Never played it again. Played it for a couple of hours. Hated it. I just flat out hated it. And then the game where I actually played a, a significant amount was Freedom Unite. Because a friend of mine uh, was teaching me how to play in Freedom Unite. And that was the, the gateway game. That was the game that I was like, no, now I understand. And now I'm getting into it. Joker Foxtrot, that's because there wasn't any downgrade. What they did with Spider-Man was that they basically... Um, they changed the texture of the suit to not be as reflective. And people were like, ah, there's no reflections on the suit anymore. And it's like, yes, because they changed the texture so that it wouldn't be as reflective. But it wasn't a graphical downgrade because they still had the potential to make the suit reflective. They just made the artistic decision not to do it. But of course, everybody loves jumping on that fucking bandwagon. The haters bandwagon. Oh yeah, man, fuck. Fucking downgrade, dude. Tell it like it is. Fucking Somniac and all this other... Everybody was singing that tune and I was just sitting there looking at it and like... I quit. Like, I don't know what you guys... I don't know. Man, these comet rocks are not making themselves available. Did you try with the motion controls? It's way better with an actual controller. I'm confused. Are you talking about Monster Hunter? There's motion controls? What? No, that can't be it. Oh, he's talking about try. Uh, yeah, I was playing with, uh, with motion controls. For try. No, Nermakian. No underwater. No, 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 no. Big no, no. Big no, no. No underwater combat. Thank you very much. No, thank you. Thank you. No, thank you. Last game you played before Monster Hunter World was Monster Hunter Freedom Unite, and you feel like you really missed out. You did. Four Ultimate was a lot of fun. Uh, Generations was all right. And now Generations Ultimate. It's pretty cool. What's your least favorite monster in Monster Hunter? In general, I don't really like um, small monsters. So... I mean, it's not like I hate them or something. It's, I don't like fighting small monsters because they're too small targets. So shit like Eodrome... Ge is it Geodrome? Yeah, Geodrome, Eodrome. Like, you know, those smaller dudes? I fucking hate them. Titiaku. Kirin. Motherfucking Sparkle Pony. Yeah, I don't like small targets.
Go play Ark or Subnautica. Not happening. I don't like Ark. I think Ark is probably one of the most boring games I've ever played. But again, it's, it's for my personal taste. I understand what some people get out of it, but it's just... I cannot get into that. Have you ever tried the Tomfa and Moss Hunter Frontier? I've never played Moss Hunter Frontier. Frontier is the ultimate. Uh, the ultimate. The, the online one, right? That's what you're talking about? Because I've never played that one. You hate the Giginox and Kezu family yourself? Yeah, dude, they are annoying. They are annoying. Kieran kicked my ass. It was great. Well, you're welcome, Paven. You're quite welcome for that. What's this? Black Pearl. But do you love Plesioth? No? No, fuck that hip checking bitch. Fuck him. Nobody likes him. thing you like about this game is when I die. Oh, man. Hey, Leroy, I never, that, that never happened. That right there is fake news, my friend. I've never gotten wrecked by Kieran. The world record lies. The Kieran world record lies in slander. Basil Goose is a bully wannabe. Because he actually gets his shit kicked in on a regular. Ooh, stamina drain. This is good. Even though it's very little stamina drain, I could work with that. For my KO set? I would want the Devil Joe to show up as much as the Basil Goose in Moss Hunter World. Yeah, Devil Joe doesn't show up nearly as often. Very rarely seen it. Rui, did you name your character, your Palico after the main character from the show Berserk? Yes. Guts. Because he's a beast Palico. He's a beast type Palico, and I just figured it'd be appropriate. Somebody's probably gonna give me a new quest, am I right? I should be getting the urgent quest soon, because I've done most of them.
Pa-bam, pa-bam. Where are you out of the four flagships? Which one is your fave? Four flagships? What are you talking about? Four flagship monsters? I like Rathalos. So what quest am I missing now? I'm probably missing a, another key quest. Urgent. Fashion victim. Okay. We're gonna go with the sword and board on this one. Am I gonna go with sword and board? Or am I gonna take my charge blade and try out a different style? I'm yet to try Alchemy Charge Blade, but I'm not sure I want to. That's kind of like tr stealing Watanagashi's Thunder, which I don't want to do. So I'm probably going to go Striker Sword and Board. Sounds like a plan. Daimyo Hedemitar is particularly weak to Fire and Lightning. He's about to have a really bad time. He's about to have a really bad fucking time. You guys ready for me to put the hurting on this bastard? Striker. Striker, you fiend! You fiend! You guys have no idea. You just have no idea. You just have no idea how much of a fiend I am with this style. But you're gonna learn. It's okay. He's gonna get it real good. Real good. He's gonna be a fashion victim, all right. Creamy waffles. Ooh, the Reno Heartful Sandwich. The Reno Heartful Sandwich. You have the Teostra set? Mm, no, I don't have it, but yes, it looks just like the one in World. So don't get your hopes up. Where are we fighting? Desert, so we gotta take some cool potions. We're just gonna go for the stamina. We're gonna wear them down. The birth of Rurikon, the serial fashion killer. Rui really trying to ignore it too. What? I'm not trying to ignore nothing. For anyone who wants to see some instant karma. Oh shit. What is this? Oh no. Is this the world record? I don't remember what this is. Oh! 
<laughs> that video is so good. I can't wait to see you get carded. <laughs> you guys should definitely watch that video if you've never watched it. I'm not saying it's a good video, but it's a pretty good clip. Thank you. He is in three. What is the helmet that has the mohawk? What? This is not a mohawk. But I'm using mostly, um, Yan Kutku gear. Have you done the G rank quest? No. I'm still in high rank. I haven't gotten the G rank. Shoot. He was right here. Now he's gone. Crap Pearl Plus. Well, I might as well take advantage of this to get myself a couple of materials. Because if you're going to be hunting him throughout the whole thing. You might as well get something out of it. Damn. You're considering doing Tigrex armor for your plugs? I've been roared out of quite a few attacks, so yeah, there is that. I know that Wada was running something with your plugs as well. How much do you need for full earplugs? Is it plus 10? I would assume. I should have brought Mind's Eye now that I think about it. Completely forgot about Mind's Eye for this guy. I also forgot about this. Man, I should have brought like a sonic bomb. turn. Now that had a hurt. Thank you. 
Oh, ho, ho, I did not expect that. I did not expect that. That was cool. Hey. No, don't get carried away now. Ow. Is he already limping, the poor little crab? Dude, he got wrecked so hard. Did you see how hard he got wrecked right there? Seems like he's getting the best of me, dude. Dude, you see the time? You see how fast he got, like, reamed hardcore? Like, th this clip right here could appear on Pornhub.com, dude. Okay? Do you understand? This, this could be a Pornhub.com video right now, is all I'm saying. <laughs> Pornographic levels of damage are taking place in this live stream. Did I just break two pickaxes in a row? How the fuck does that even happen? How do you break two pickaxes in a row? I'm a dwarf for crying out loud. Shouldn't even be breaking pickaxes to begin it. Lewd levels of damage. Yes. That that's good. That's good, hurt my base. I like that. I'm stealing that. Lewd levels of damage so that I don't have to constantly say pornographic. Although I do feel like pornographic is a little bit more hardcore of a pun. So it'd be pornographic if the damage was real good. And then lewd if it's like, well, that was alright. That was good. That was lewd. Is this revenge for the daimyo that wrecked you in Moss Hunter for Ultimate? Did I get wrecked by a daimyo in for Ultimate? I don't remember. I told you guys when I started this quest that this dude was going to get the remage of his life. I did not lie. The thing about Striker is losing momentum. You have to keep those specials going. I love striker style. I love striker style for sword and shield. I think right now this is my favorite play style in Generations Ultimate. Be careful of YouTube justice strike on me. Justice strike? What? You can have an old pickaxe last round five times, but an iron pickaxe would better break after just a few. I know, right? Isn't that weird? It's almost like the game is cheating. This is husks, right? I don't do husks, bruh. So tired. So tired. You still have... Oh yeah, the, the old village farm from Freedom Unite, huh? Guess I kind of missed that too. They did oversimplify that. I think the way it used to be was fine. The Arbalist. Do you ever think we're going to get frontier weapons in the main games? Doubt it. They'll probably do different ones, because they've done, like, 
Frontier has had weapons that haven't been in Monster Hunter, and then Monster Hunter launched weapons that haven't been in Frontier, rather than go after the Frontier ones, right? At least that's the way that I seem to remember it. I miss Nursilla. I miss Nursilla so much. Nursilla is awesome. I love Nursilla. She's weak to fire as well. Sounds good to me. I'm wondering if I should take Charge Blade or Sword and Shield. I don't know how hard I can put the reaming on Nursilla with Sword and Shield. Let's find out. Dude, Nursilla is beast mode. Beasto modo. Primal Force, perfect. Don't even need to take cool drinks or anything. Now, for Nursilla, I'm wondering if I should take Stamina or Destroyer. I think we're gonna go with Destroyer. I'm gonna break her real good. I'm gonna bust her face real good. Oh, I even got the creamy waffles. I even got the creamy waffles just for you, Nursilla. The creamy waffles. Nursilla going to get them creamy. <clears throat> Are you ready? Also, guys, just a quick reminder. If you guys are enjoying the live stream, hitting it with a like helps out a lot. Always. And uh, if you guys are new here, consider subscribing so that you get notified whenever I go live. I do a lot of Master Hunter stuff. I've also been playing a lot of World of Warcraft. Been leveling up a whole new tune. A Dark Iron Dwarf. Those have actually been mainly, these have been mainly the two games I've been playing. G Ultimate, World of Warcraft, and I'll be doing World next Thursday. For sure. We're gonna give Nursilla a little bit of lewd. Just a little bit of lewdness. What do you guys think about that? I actually don't remember Nursilla's moveset at all, other than the web swinging. Oh! Oh! This little piece of garbage. Oh, you're gonna die for that. I mean, surely you understand that I can't let you live after what you just did. Now let's talk with your friend. Your friend's gonna get the bash. Did that hurt? Just, just repeatedly bash him in the face with a shield. That's what you get. Pink. You motherfuckers should have learned not to do that to me. Advanced armor sphere. Oh, hi, Nursilla. Jesus Christ. I've only ever seen her on the 3DS. She looks so much nastier on here. Yeah. Ah, God, I forgot she does that. Yeah. That's terrible. Oh, God. Please, no. 
I forgot that she did some really weird shit. Oh my god. Oh, when she pulled out the pincers from the inside. Ugh. And I got wet. She's really fast. Ah, I got the pincers. Oh god, she actually got me with that nasty shit. Stay down! Damn it, just wasted my biggest damage dealing art. Okay, cats, you're not really healing me all that much now, are you? Where are my heels at? Oh, you look tired. exactly how to get there. I think it's through here, hopefully. We'll see. <clears throat> Wife who wants to sleep now? No, no, no. Gonna give her the permanent sleep. Oh no, this is a dead end. Dead end! Damn it, there goes the chaos oil. I had my blade all looped up for her and everything. This is disrespectful. All this foreplay, no action. She even exited in this direction. I'm such an idiot. That should have been a dead giveaway. She kicked me out. She kicked me out of the room. First she wastes my lube, and then she kicks me out of the room. This is just not acceptable. Hmm. 
Varia Valentine? No, I'm using Destroyer right now. But whenever I do uh, my Chaos Oil special art, I get all the oils. You're gonna stay up there. Oh, wait. Come on up. So I go down. You come up, I come up, you go down. Wow, she got me three times in a row with that shit. Does she have a conchu on her leg? I didn't know she could do that. That's pretty cool. gonna go where are you gonna go Nursilla you can't run away now Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate is so much cheesier than world what what do you mean by that cheesier from the monsters from the players Oh man, I thought that I had gotten round force, but I actually got chaos oil. So that's why it was a little bit awkward at the end there, because I like I heard the zing and I was like, okay, that's probably round force. So I went for round force, nothing happened. I was like, the fuck's going on? There's the round force. But I'm gonna hit her up with a chaos oil first now. I just need her to give me a little bit of an opening. She's a little bit too excitable right now. Dude, she is not stopping. Silly, you hear that noise? That means we've been here too long. Marcilla, you're really pushing me right now. Come on.
I should have brought the stamina oil. Oh my god. I hate fighting you here. Can you flash her out of that? You probably could. Thing to remember, I need to bring flash bombs next time I fight Marcella. Actually, let's go fight upstairs. It's probably a better idea. Oh my god, that was a wombo! Yeah, you liked that, didn't ya? The only thing we needed right now was to get the sword dance. Yeah, you better run. You guys see that wombo? Yeah, Ryder. <laughs> Remounting, thinking, take that, you slag. You filthy slag. You gotta be close to come up on, um, on sword dance, though. I'm up. I'm not fighting you down there because you always have the home advantage if we're down there. Damn it, really? Fuck it, I'm just gonna sharpen right in your face. Deal with that. Fine. Damn it, I knew I was gonna get dicked over. Knew it. But I was just so eager to unload. Where are my heels, cats? She's all kinds of messed up. Cats better get my heels. Wow, we cracked her. Look at how cracked up she is right now. I don't even want to use another oil. Like, we're done. We're done. Wait, 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 wait. You're not going to trick me like this again, are you? This is the way. This is the way, I think. Okay, oh, there. This is high rank. I haven't gotten to G rank yet. I'm trying to beeline to G rank. Oh, she's sleeping. Well, let's fill up on round force. Thank you. Now let's round force your face. Your face!
She was a tough little cookie to crack. Took considerably longer than the other ones. Let's see what we're gonna get in rank eight uh, stars, not rank eight, uh, yeah. eight stars. ship ticket the cat's probably gonna give us more permits I have 99 of everything except oh not everything See what other armors I can craft now. Zam Trios Plus Survivor Ten Mounting and Vaulting Fencing and Hearing. I've killed a Garuga Plus. Oh yeah, I did. I even did it on the video, now that I think about it. Haphazard, Guard, Sharpener, Guardian Suit. This is one of the suits that I want to craft. It's got artillery on it. Artillery also affects charge blades on here, right? You need 15 points in artillery. Priscilla gives constitution and status. Malfestio's got the tenderizer. I kind of think that the next one we got to do is guardian. <clears throat> so I need to kill a Sianator. Sianator. Let's see which monsters we're getting next. I see it rolling. 
Shogun Sianator. There we go. It's exactly what we wanted. So this is probably going to be the next thing that I'm going to want to go kill. Nibble Snarf. Wrong bird, idiots. High rank Garuga. Shell game. I could probably do with uh, a Garuga set. So that's probably going to be the next set that I'm going to farm. Lagonga. Cool stuff. Anyway, you guys, for today, that is going to be it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this stream. As per usual, if you do enjoy it, like it. If you guys are new here, hit that subscribe button so that you guys are notified. No, so that you guys may be notified. Then hit the bell icon so that you're definitely notified. I love you all. And um, probably the next big stream that we'll have is going to be Thursday night. Plan to make that one a little bit longer. So be aware of that. It'll probably start around 10 or 11 p.m. British Standard Time. So that we can really, really get into all of the events that are going to be available on Masana World. Probably run a couple of lobbies with Colf to Roth. As well as... Um, What's the other one? Extreme Behemoth. I know you guys are going to want to have Extreme Behemoth. But yeah, love you all. See you guys on the next stream.